And here we go again with the FOMO. What's going on, everyone? In this video, we're going to be talking about why you should not FOMO into the Paldier Evolved set and specifically the singles for this set. So I've already shown you how you can get um, the products for the set for much cheaper than retail. And if you've missed my videos for those, uh, for, if you've missed those videos or if you're new to the channel, all that kind of stuff, I suggest you go back and watch those videos for the deals that are still available for this set like for the booster boxes, ETBs, etc. Um, yes, they're pre-order deals, but they're, they're still available. Um, great prices and all that kind of stuff. So go watch those. But uh, we're going to talk about the singles. So um, in general, this set's not that good. Um, there's like the one big card that everyone wants. Big card because it's a waifu. It's the Iono card or however you pronounce her name. Iono, Iono, whatever. Um, so let's, let's just look at this really quick. So the special illustration rare for this card, the number 269 out of 193, um, is, uh, it's on TCG player, you know, obviously there are only eight listings because somehow some people already have them, I don't know how, whatever, they already have them if there were pre-releases pre going on or whatever, so people pulling them um, very early and uh, the lowest listing is at like 212-ish, um, and then it goes to 265, two, and then it goes to like 300 and 400 something. And then someone's like, oh, let's put it up for a thousand. You know, let's just put it up for a thousand and see what happens. Uh, I cannot show you the uh, sales data yet on TCG player or any of this because it's, it, it's, they haven't gathered enough data, but okay. Look at these prices and tell me, like you tell me what's going to happen to this. Let me show you something really quick. These, this is eBay. These listings are actual sold listings for this card actual sold listings and i have it sold completed all that stuff and i have it by uh ended recently so this is an order of ended recently um yeah right here so where to see okay uh what they bought two of the illustr uh, the of this one they bought two of this one and then one of the other one i'm going to talk about that's for 500. They had an old best offer, so I don't know what the best offer was. But let's see, here we go. This was a bid. This was an auction. They bought it for 200, 250 plus tax. 285 plus five. Why are you charging shipping on a car that's $285? That, that's ridiculous. Anyways, it's for 285 plus 505 shipping plus tax. Again, uh, another 200 something. Another 200. Another, like this, oh my God, 300 something, but or best offer. 200 uh, ish. 200 ish. Like, what are these prices? This is insane. This is insane. These are all sold listings. All of these are sold listings. Every single one of them. Look at how many. Why are you spending so much money on this card right now? It hasn't even come out. Like, I, I really don't get it. Are you scared that it's just going to not exist? Or is it? are you just so, in, so um, what, uh, um, uh, turned on by uh, such a waifu card or something? Like, I don't get it. Like, what, what's the thing? What, what's, what's going on here? Um, I'm going to show you, here's the, I, the ultra rare version of it, seventies, eighties, whatever. Then it goes up to hundred something for some reason. Okay. So let's go back to Scarlet and Violet if we can. So here's, let me show you Miriam, the special illustration rare. Okay. What happened when it first came out? What happened when it first came out? Here we go. When it first came out, people were listing it for 200s because there was there were no other listings, right? And what's the price at right now? It's under 60. It's under 60. You can get it right now near mint for $56 plus tax. But yeah, it's under $60 right now. If you go to eBay and I go to sold but by the highest, highest to lowest, right? So ignore the ones that are graded. Someone spent, like, this is the best offer, offer, but let's say $500 on a Miriam card when it first came out, and then this is on March 17th. $450. Someone, one bid. Congrats. You won an auction with, you were the only one to spend, you want, who wanted to spend $450 plus on this card, March 25th. Um, another one. Look at, look at, these prices are insane. Imagine, forget, forget the graded ones, but imagine spending that much money on a card that is now in the 50s i mean it's obvious this is when the set hasn't come out people have it early and it's gonna it's it's low supply high demand 
And then once people start opening the set and then forgetting about it because all these other sets are coming out, there is high supply, low demand, the prices drop, people ripping open packs, etc., etc. Prices will drop. Imagine, I just want you to imagine spending this much money and then one day it's like 50 something and you're like, wow, I just lost $300 or something like that. Like, what? <laughs> I don't understand. I really, really don't understand. Please do not FOMO. Do not FOMO into these singles. So, yes, everyone wants this card. It's the new waifu card. Whoa. Do not FOMO into it. It's going to start out very high and then it's going to gradually drop. And if you think I'm wrong, well, oh, because in Japan, the price was so much, yada, yada. Well, so was the Miriam card, wasn't it? Am I mistaken? Um, but yeah, the price of, the the price is so high in Japan, everyone wants it. I, and what, what do you know? Um, supply and demand? Like, okay. Um, so if you look at the rest of the set, the rest of this, I don't even know why it doesn't show up when I put it on here, but like, then it just like... <laughs> just drops drastically well here's an 80 dollars card but then it just drops drastically anyways the, these prices are all fake these are all gonna drop drastically they're all fake do not fomo into this set uh especially for the new waifu card um but yeah hope you uh understand that and agree with me and if you don't then let me know why but it's fine to you I and mean, it's your money you can do whatever you want with it i'm just saying like if you want to be not smart with your money that's up to you that's all you man um but uh, yeah, so let me know in the comments down below what you think of this. Um, let me open a pack from uh, GameStop because it's the five, you know, the five dollar thing a month. So this was for May, and I just got it. What was it? May thirty first or third? No, the thirtieth. So let's just open it now because uh, I forgot to open it in my last video. Let's do it now. Um, I had to get the one with the Gyarados, but unfortunately, this is not. Unfortunately, this is not the Gyarados art. Um have not hit anything good with the uh, uh, monthly packs so we'll see what we can get and i'm not gonna do any pack tricks i'm just gonna go like this did i see it? Oh, oh okay what is this this is something that looks nice but it's probably worth nothing uh iron treads ex this is probably like the best card that i've got <laughs> from uh from uh from any of these like five dollar just the five dollar a month things so let's see iron treads ex uh which one is this this oh my god yeah that's that's hilarious so it looks cool right should i give you an over-the-top reaction like a bunch of youtubers do oh my gosh um yeah this price is uh a with the shipping a dollar something <laughs> hey it's free but still um the other thing was uh there were two reverse hollows right here um that's it oh and then here's a code card if anyone wants it all right but i didn't spend anything on it so whatever it is what it is all i know is that um if you are spending this much money on it i don't think you know what you're doing um but you know all you all you all i know is that this miriam card went all the way down all right, let me know in the comments down below what you think and what you plan on doing. Please like, share, subscribe, all that kind of stuff, and have a good day or night wherever you are. Bye-bye.